and we're going to change everybody around. Very a half-time pep talk for an unusual team. Fantastic. Playing Fiji in an international competition, this is the peace team. Half Israeli, half Palestinian, playing Aussie rules football in Sydney. This match, no triumph in terms of the score, but if ever a cliche were valid, it's here. It's not the winning, but the taking part that counts. Seen a Palestinian boy, Shepard, an Israeli boy, says, hey, listen, I've got you, I've got you covered, champ. And you think, wow, where does that come from, you know? Fantastic. The peace team is the initiative of an Australian woman in conjunction with the Paris Centre for Peace and the Al-Quds Association. Aussie Rules, or AFL, is a new game for all the players, but it's been community, particularly Palestinian, suspicion of the mixed team rather than the actual game that posed the greatest threat to their participation in the AFL International Cup. There was a brief moment before we came out where we thought the project may be on the line and players you know, weren't, weren't keen to come out, but they decided you know, that the, this project is too important. Despite the rain, training in a Sydney park is relatively straightforward compared with sessions back home. There, players from the West Bank have to endure checkpoints to get to training in Israel. The Israeli government won't let Israeli players travel to the West Bank for practice at all. Sometimes it took about three hours, three hours and a half to be to, just to go to, uh, to the practice. You know, they took a long time when the check went to check our ID, check the bags. You know, we're going to practice. We have uh, boots, we have uh, clothes, we have everything. They took a uh, long time. At the end of the day, we both have to face challenges at home from our communities. And that's the idea of this team. The idea is to go back to the communities, face those challenges and confront those people that are against it. We're not here to talk happy, happy, joy, joy with people that are already yeah. all for the peaceful solution. Three matches and three losses down, the peace team holds out higher hopes for their forthcoming games against China and France. Aussie rules players in those countries are as rare as they are in the Middle East. This may not be a conventional peace initiative, but it is one that's novel. Andrew Thomas, Al Jazeera, Sydney.